Okay, right, what were we doing? Cyber dude had sold. Uh, I think we needed to get... Oh. Uh, new game platform, Vena Gear by Vena has been released. I think we needed to get a million dollars or million credits to be, able to, move, uh, to be able to move into an office. So let's... Develop a new game. Right, what have we got? Sci-fi, limit youngsters. An adventure game. Um, let's go. F I know we're supposed to be saving money, but let's let's try it. Right. On the game link. Let's try and use the action engine. This is going to put us in the red. We'll call it Captain Awesome. Oh. There we go, yeah, we're in the red. Mm, not fantastic. sci-fi adventure. I don't think the dialogue has to be fantastic. Not too much. Yeah, let's go for level design. Don't scratch your head, don't scratch your head, you keep moving. You keep programming. G64 taken off the market. Okay, that's finished. Four bugs to fix. Come on. Come on. Finish it. Release it. Give me money. How's that done? Seven. Nice experience. Very good. Seven. Beautiful. Nine. Great game. That's good. We're, we're getting better with these. Captain Awesome. We need Captain Awesome to rank 16, that's good. Hardware manufacturers around the world were surprised today as Govador, the creator of G64, has filed for bankruptcy. Govador failed to introduce a higher priced alternative and was forced to shut down production of G64. The platform will retire from the market later this month. Well, it's okay because we've got the Tez and the Game Link. Two games on the G64, which earned us 184k. Mm. What? This is a very 
very special offer. Our agents have recently managed to borrow some research information which might be of interest to you. If you are interested, then transfer 28k to the enclosed uplink location. We will contact you. Agent Blowfish. Hmm. What's the worst that can happen? Ah, we have successfully researched school. Let's have a look at the research. Mm. Oh, school's down there. Let's do Wild West. Let's get some cowboy games going. <coughs> Excuse me. Good, that's still... that's making us money. Money is good. Let's research. I don't think we're I don't think we're ready for open world design. Let's put some money into marketing. Captain Awesome is now off the market. It sold 77,000 units, generating hmm, 540,000. You've successfully researched marketing. You can access the marketing options in the action menu, but only while the game is being developed. That's cool. Can we create a new engine yet? Gamepad. Simple cutscenes. We'll do this one. This will be improved. Action. Uh, improved story. Saitori? Story. That's okay. That's okay, we've still got money. Simple cutscenes are going in. Perfect. Right. Got a new game. I want it for everyone. I already know it's going to be a Wild West game, so we're just going to call it Buffalo Soldier. Pick the genre. We want action. Now... I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to go, going to go onto the PC. Because we can use the hopefully hopefully the gamepad accessory will be useful. Here we go. Add in the simple cutscenes. Here we go. Engine level three, gameplay level three. Marketing. Let's see what this does. Don't invest too much, and remember that timing is important. It is also important to know that no matter how much money you pump into marketing, it will not make a bad game successful. Hmm. Magazines, so we've got magazines, magazines and demos. Small campaign, 
large campaign. Oh, that's expensive, right? So I'll wait for stage two. Oh, here we go. It's all, it's all flying up there now. Level design. AI. There we go. Right. Marketing. Let's do magazines and demos. Let's let's risk it. We got a hypers building. Oh, design graphics. Let's let's keep it like that. Hypers at 13. I'm not sure if that's good or not. It's finished. New record on technology. Let's see how it does. Let's see what the reviews are like. Shows potential. Beautiful. Nice experience. Enjoyable. But slightly better than average. That's that's cool. I can handle that. Let's see how the money comes in. Three months to make back the money. Let's do some contract work to uh, one hundred and sixty K. The Vena Oasis comes with sixty ooh, sixteen bit. We need to pay back 160 grand. Um, pick a topic, right? Let's do. Let's try school. Can we be young? School simulation? See, a part of me wants to. Let's do it. Let's do it in a game link. We use the improved story engine. I think because it's aimed at kids, or young, lots of gameplay. Because it's aimed at kids, I don't really think... Gameplay and engine will be my main focus. I didn't even... ah, I didn't name it. It's going to be called Game 12. Gonna make the sequels uh, interesting to number. Don't want it too intelligent. It is aimed at youngsters. Not too sure about the level. There we go. Game number twelve. Not fantastic. Vena Oasis. Cool. Let's do it. There we go. That's cool. We've paid back the bailout. 
Now I have to try and just make hits. Do some marketing. Just a, a little, little magazine article. graphics version 3 3d graphics version 1 interesting do some research right well we can't really can't afford these yet definitely can't so for the minute let's just research a new topic post-apocalyptic seem better. Our review inspired by the game's name. Bad Review 5. Bad Review 6. Has its... Well, it's it is shockingly average, apparently. Right, well. We'll see how this first week goes, and then I'll end the video. Anything? Anything? Ooh. Well, we'll come back to that. We'll see how it does. Uh, as always, if you like what you've seen, like, subscribe, favorite. We'll catch you later.